I'm an astronomer who's been working on the Milky Way for a while now, but it still confuses me when I look at images to try to understand what people mean when they say a two-arm spiral or a four-arm spiral or even just a spiral in general. So let's just take a look at a typical image from one of the many papers about the structure of the Milky Way. Uh, this one claims that the Milky Way is a four-arm spiral. And you see data superimposed on a famous cartoon by Robert Hurt that was originally based on data from the Spitzer Space Telescope. These data are uh, from a survey of massive star forming regions and using those to find the structure. But for right now, that's not important. What's important is where are the arms, okay? Let's just look exactly for the four arms that people are talking about in this paper. Okay, here's the image. And then if we superimpose, if we just use colors to trace out what I think they mean, this is what they're saying, okay? It's not super clear with that image in the background, so let's take the image away. Uh, it's still a little bit hard to see what's going on, and there seems to be extra stuff. So let's just look at one arm at a time. Let's start with just putting the bar down in the center of the galaxy. We're pretty sure that the galaxy has an elongated structure in the middle that's called the bar. And then these arms would typically come off the bar. So here's a nice one. That's the Scutum Centaurus arm. Okay, and this one, the Perseus arm, is pretty clear to understand too. And it gets a little bit worse. So the Norma arm here is this light green one. And then there's another newly claimed arm called the outer arm, which at least in the picture looks like it could extend off the Norma arm. Whether that's true, I'm not sure I know or that anyone knows. What's this yellow thing? That's the Sagittarius arm, another famous arm uh, of the Milky Way, and part of it is very near the sun. So here's the sun. When we look toward the center of the galaxy, which is the bar, we see the Scutum Centaurus arm about three kiloparsecs away, and maybe little pieces of the Sagittarius arm, but maybe not, because then there's this other structure that's claimed to be something called the Orion Spur, in which we sit, and then there's this other kind of purpley thing that I drew in here, which is unlabeled uh, in the paper that we were looking at on the original cartoon. But if we just look at numbers, okay, so let's just say how many arms are there. If we took the outer arm, maybe in concert with the Norma arm, that could be one. The Perseus arm could be two. Sagittarius could be three. And Scutum Centaurus could be four. So I think that's what these four arms are. Let's just say here in this picture are not exactly four arms, but four arms-ish. So there's your four arm Milky Way spiral. And for most of you, I'll stop just there. But if you keep playing, you get a special bonus for galactic structure experts here, which shows you the Roman numerals labeling the quadrants of the galaxy so that you know when you look from the sun in which direction, which quadrant of the galaxy has which arms in it. Hope that's helpful. Bye-bye.